guys, it is December 2nd, Monday. Uh, I already, it's already 2 o'clock, it's almost 2 o'clock, it's 5 till. I'm gonna move real fast. Um, this morning I went to the bank, I went to the post office, I went to Walmart to grab, I needed some more apples. Me and Jessica eat apples like crazy. I got some apples and some a cucumber. What else did we get? Oh, we got a board game. Kind of a board game. <laughs> Jesse's starting to like playing stuff like that, so we got him one. It's called um, Greedy Granny. <laughs> it's a little fun. We played it a lot. I'll put in a clip actually here in a minute of us playing it. It was so funny. We're going to start buying some more board games for him so he can learn how to play them the right way. Because <laughs> if he does go start to uh, pre K next year, he'll need to know how to, you know, not get, not cheat and not get mad when he doesn't win. That's the goal at least. But I got some mail um, before we left on our trip, and then I got some cards today, and I wanted to share it with you guys real fast. So I'm going to get it and share it with you, if I can get it all situated. Alright, I'll see here. This first one is from Australia, which is really cool. And it's from Leah. I said it last time. I got something from Aaliyah, and I, I pronounced it Lee. <laughs> and then Devin was talking to me, because he was opening the mail I was driving. And he, I said, it's from Lee from Australia. And he said, that's Leah. <laughs> He's like, there's an H on the end of it. So if I've ever pronounced Leah wrong, I'm sorry, guys. But it's from Australia. And it's got a really cool stamp. And it's not going to focus because I don't have a fancy phone. But it looks like it's a Rudolph with a Christmas pudding on a platter. And there's a crab coming down out of a tree to eat it. And there's like all kinds of other food on there. It says Australian Christmas Island. That's so cool. I love stamps. <laughs> but, uh, her Christmas card that she sent me is Santa holding a lantern with a candle in it. <laughs> and she wrote a note in there. Okay, she also sent along with it a little ornament. A crochet Christmas tree. So I'm going to put that on the tree now that I um, show it to you guys. I'm also going to, you know, I'll, I'll keep all the cards and stuff anyways. So I'm also going to scribble. If she, I don't know if she mentioned it. <laughs> I'm going to scribble on there somewhere that she gave me this. So that, you know, in years from now I can remember that this specific ornament came with this card. <laughs> but uh, thank you so much, Leah, for that. <laughs> Leah, oh, I have to say it that way. Because Devin. Okay, that's Sam's Club. We don't need that. Oops. That's garbage, too. Okay. That's regular mail. Y'all don't need to see regular boring mail. Alright. I also got a package that day, but I'll show that last because it's easier to... Show the cards first. I got this card today, and it's from Nicole from Canada. She is from Darab Creations. My heat just kicked on, but I'm not turning it off because it's cold in here. But she sent me the cutest little um, card. It is so cute. It's got a hedgehog on it, and there's like gold sparkle stuff on it. It's just an adorable little card, and you have a really nice penmanship too. <laughs> I wish I could write pretty. But also the card, the envelope is one of the. Uh, ones with extra pizzazz and then it's got a cool um stamp too it's a canadian stamp obviously because from canada that's like a scenic i don't know if it, it doesn't say where it is but i'm sure it's some somewhere up there <laughs> all right and then the last card that i got was from bridget and it's queen's crochet and knits and this is another one she also sent some stitch markers and it went through the envelope <laughs> but her stamp is a butterfly and she is from South Carolina, but you can see there's holes, and there's also holes on the front. But the stitch markers made it, <laughs> they didn't die. And it also went through the card. <laughs> there, there's the holes where it went through the card. That's just because of the thing that they slide it through to sort the mail. Um, it's a tight fit, that's because only certain size envelopes will fit through there or else it will cost more to ship them. And uh, stuff just gets squished that way. But she sent me one with Santa also. Uh, getting gifts out of his bag. It says believe. What are you doing sneaking around? I see you over there. Do you like a potty? Go in there. I gotta go check it on her. But she sent two stitch markers. They got little sea turtles on them, which I love sea turtles, and pink and purple balls. And I gotta check on Jesse. Okay, we're back. <laughs> Alright, the last um, mail that I got. This came on Friday before we went on our trip. And it is from Yarn Happens, which is in Florida. 
it just came in a package so it doesn't have a cool stamp <laughs> it just has a regular package stamp but she sent me a really cool gift and i can't wait to uh do it she sent me the 12 days of christmas gift like an advent thing like the 12 days countdown to christmas <laughs> but she also sent me a card and this is the card that was in uh the package it's got like I'm not sure if that's supposed to be holly because that's a pine that's pine tree and holly doesn't grow on pine trees but it's like holly berries <laughs> or cranberries maybe uh and some pine and uh she she wrote me a really nice message and she also uh it's 12 days of christmas and it's just small uh tokens of her admiration and appreciation which is really sweet and she also sent jesse a package right here i haven't let him open it yet and i'm actually gonna wait to let him open it until the 14th of December when I open that first one so that he can open one too and um, won't feel left out. Actually that day he's also going to get to go to a party at Devin's work and get a toy from Santa. So he'll have a good day that day and also it's also the day of our um, city's parade so he's going to have a good day that day. But that's going to be a good like pre-Christmas um, thing for him. Even Devin was super excited when he opened this for me because, like I said, I was driving and we were already on our way to our vacation because we ran by the post office. I had to mail a package and then um, I checked the mail while I was there. And so I was driving towards the interstate and he was opening these, uh, the mail for me. And he opened it and he was excited that of all the little packages that was in there. I already got them in order sitting on my, in my desk. But she sent, let me see if I can pick them all up at once. They're just little gifts. They're in like little treat bags and they're wrapped up in there like in tissue paper. And there's this one is Christmas Eve. I think it's big. And a little heavy. <laughs> and then this is the first day and it's December 14th. So that's two Saturdays from now. <laughs> I haven't opened any of them. I haven't snuck any peeks. I'm super excited. I've never gotten anything like that so I can't wait to actually do that so thank you so much i can't wait to um rip into those <laughs> but her name her actual name her her yarny name is yarn happens and her actual name is marianne which is a really pretty name <laughs> you have really nice penmanship too you always notice everybody's penmanship because i'm a nerd but yeah jesse's gonna be excited about this i think i know what this is just by feeling it oh, he's hollering i hear back okay also today i wanted to do a quick um update on what I've been crocheting because <laughs> I have not crocheted enough at all to do a no hitch name episode because you know Thanksgiving week and we're getting ready for our trip and all that just been super busy so I did I do have three finished objects oh gosh that is way smaller I'm seeing that now that they're laying together but that's okay um I have a secret Santa swap for the video I put out a while ago a couple weeks ago that was a secret Santa for a charity um after that, you know, the event was over, everybody who participated in it gets mixed up and we each get to buy someone <laughs> uh, gifts, you know, a secret Santa swap, but a secret Santa. <laughs> like, I know who I got, but I don't know who got me, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> so, uh, I've been watching the person that I got some videos and trying to get an idea of what they like uh, so I can, I'll probably pull a bunch of stuff out of my stash, my yarn and stuff, and uh, some stitch markers and things like that. And plus, I also wanted to make something, too. So I made some dishcloths, and um, I think I'm going to give them the two red ones, and I'm going to keep the multicolor ones. But anyways, I made this first one. It's just made with uh, some red cotton that was gifted to me by Becky from, from Funny Farm Crochet. I think it's uh, the Bernat cotton, but I'm not 100% sure. But it's made with the Cobble Stitch uh, tutorial by Bag of Day Crochet. And what it is, you can't really see it that good. <laughs> It looks like bubbles kind of and what it is it's a single crochet and then a treble treble crochet single treble single treble and because of the singles on either side of the treble it makes it pop out so that's what that is and i did a just a single crochet border around it and then this one what is this one i'm trying to remember this is the same yarn and this all i did for this one was um i think this is the one where it's a let me look at it yeah, this is the one where it's um, going one way, you do single, uh, double, in, the, in each stitch, a single and a double. And then when you chain one and turn back, you do opposite. You um, 
No, that's not right. In the single crochet, you do... I can't remember. Ah, I can't remember this. <laughs> Let's see here. When you start it, you make a whole row single crochet and then you chain one and turn and then you do single double skip single double skip single double skip and then you chain one turn back the other way and you skip the double crochets and you do single double and the single crochets and that's what gives it that it looks like they're kind of leaning to the side y'all can't see it that good because of the lighting but it's a pretty texture I like it I don't know what it's called moss stitch maybe something like that but I'm gonna give my partner these two and they're roughly the same size. <laughs> the um, they're I think this top one is a little bit bigger, but they're roughly the same size. Then I also made out of some more yarn that she gifted me. This one, I just uh, I was gonna make this as a set, but it's so much smaller. <laughs> so I'll keep the multicolor ones, and it's like a um, Christmas colors. And this one I did a roll single crochet, and then a single crochet, chained one, single crochet. Single crochet, chain one, skip one, single crochet, all the way across, and then when I turned and uh, chained one and turned, I did a single crochet in the single crochet, and then I did a double crochet in the skipped one from the row before, kind of like spike stitches, uh, and then I just did that to build it the whole dishcloth size, but it's a whole lot smaller than those red ones. And then I'm working on another one that is the cobblestone stitch again, but it's in the um, the variegated yarn. Yeah. I get it all. This is the one I was working on in Gatlinburg. <laughs> I didn't get much done at all because I didn't crochet a lot there. Uh, we were busy, you know, doing family stuff. But I'll just keep these myself. And I think this is actually coming out bigger. Yeah, this one's coming out bigger than the first multicolored one too. But that's okay. I will use these for myself because I actually love using crochet knitted dishcloths uh, better than like the store bought ones. So. Yeah, that's all I've been crocheting on. I need to finish that. And I got some more yarn. This is all I got left of the red. And then I got this much so far the variegated. I got to finish that one dishcloth. And then I'll probably put those two together to make it like a weird looking dishcloth. And uh, have those for myself. But I have these three finished. That's all I've been doing. I've been using a eye hook. Right? Yeah. An eye hook. I'm going to make sure before I say that. I know the pink is eye. Five, five. 5.5 for that, and um, it's living in my Crafty Nomad bag. I took this two gallon bird with me. But like I said, I only worked on it a smidge there because I was busy. But that's pretty much everything, I think, for right now. Uh, I don't have anything else planned to do today uh, that's worth filming for Vlogmas. I am working on some bags. I had some leftover Christmas material. I'm making one of these for my swap partner for the Secret Santa. I haven't figured out which one yet. <laughs> but I got these all. These are like the outside of the bag, all the way done. Labels and everything. I just got to make the liners and then put them together. But um, all the ones that I don't put in my swap package will just go on the shop uh, whenever I get them done. And uh, just trying to use up this Christmas material. I had a stack still back there. And um, I know by next Christmas time I'll get more material. So I want to try to use up what I have. So there's two penguins. And there's two of these snowmen that are fat. <laughs> Little fat snowmen. There's this one... Um, Muppets, it's like Sesame Street Muppets. It's smaller and it kind of is word shaped because <laughs> the, the material I was working with, I only had a little tiny bit that I got at the thrift store. And uh, I went ahead and made a bag anyways, but it's going to be smaller than my normal bags just by a little bit. But there'll be one of those. And then there's going to be two of this print. It's like a rustic Christmas print. It's got Santa and snowman and an angel, like a house. Two of those. And then just two snowflakes. It's like a cream color with gold snowflakes on it. So all of those will be in the shop except one of them I'm going to use for my swap partner. And these are all the liners. <laughs> the bags will be lined with these later. I'll finish sewing those later. And then I'll sit and do the drawstrings in the living room while watching TV. But yeah, so now I've got all this mail showed. I can hang up my cards and put away the advents or the... Christmas countdown I will um I guess I'll just leave it there in order so I can grab it and <laughs> go I'll, I'll show that every day when I open those but that won't start until the 14th and yeah I guess that's everything else for today uh, I might throw another clip in later I will throw a clip after this one of us playing that game and then maybe something else after that I don't know but right now I'm not gonna planning on filming anything 
because I'm doing a thing today, but staying home and maybe uh, finishing a dishcloth. <laughs> but I'll see you guys in the next video, whenever that is. Bye, guys. Now, I got one number one, Daddy. I got right. the no, no, here, spin it. Since we're all here, we gotta spin it. Spin it. All right, now you gotta push the button once and then grab a cookie. <gasps> Good job, it's Daddy's turn. Three times. <gasps> Daddy's gotta push the button three times. Hey, come here. Come over here. I am so scared of that. Oh, you didn't do it's it. It's Mama's turn. It's Mama's turn now. Keep your cookie. Yes. Oh, Whoa. I gotta read it twice. Can I just get one cookie? Yeah, just. I think I read the instructions wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I stacked up. Oh, she woke up. I hear your teeth are gone. And I grab a cookie. Grab a cookie. Nom, 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 nom. Yum, right. cookie. Here goes Daddy. Daddy's turn. Three times. Uh oh. oh There's gonna push it three times. He's gonna wake Granny up. It's purple too, so I ain't gotta grab a cookie. Ah. <gasps> It's Jesse's turn. Spin it. Oh, you gotta push it two times and grab a cookie. Oh, I don't want to. You can do it. Come on. It's you funny. It, Just push it two times Remember, and grab a cookie. Remember, it's funny. Okay, I'm gonna grab a cookie. Oh, it's gonna do it when Daddy does it. It's gonna do it when Daddy does it. Come here and watch. It's gonna scare Daddy. Three times. Daddy's gonna get scared. Daddy woke up great. Did she spit her teeth out? No, they're still no. in there. I think I got a, I got them in upside down. I think they're on the bottom. 